Good morning. So this week I have for you all a week of gym fits video. This week I'm going to be wearing all Gymshark training. I'm excited a little bit. I'm a little nervous. I, I picked up a few new training items from Gymshark's website and also I have not touched a bulk of my training items in like a year. So um, I'm ready to like pop them back out of the closet, wear them again, kind of remember what it was I loved about them to begin with. Um, so let's see. For this, for this video style, there are three main mm, points, I guess, I want to cover. So the first one is fabric performance. The second is outfit comfortability, such as did I find myself needing to adjust the items and did I just physically feel comfortable in these outfits overall? And then finally, the cuteness factor. How cute is it? You know, just things like that. So let's go ahead and pull out some items and let me try to find something to wear because I need to go to the gym right now. Alrighty, so here are some items that I pulled out of my closet. So what I love about the training collection from Gymshark is that everything's like a solid color. You can mix and match. You can wear with like so many other brands, so many different textures. Um, and then also like, they're just like super comfortable to wear. I do have a few pairs of leggings from Gymshark, um, but I don't work out in the Gymshark training leggings just because they don't really stay up on my body. I find myself like um, pulling them up all the time. So yeah, that's why. Um, so let's see. I feel like there's some stuff missing, but I kind of like this vibe here. Everything's like bright and colorful. So let's go ahead and pick something out for me to wear for today, which is a leg day. All right, so I tried to organize everything a little bit better. So we have some socks, some neutral bras and then more colorful bras and then there's a long sleeve crop in here and then we have our shorts so i'm already looking there are one two three four five shorts so that means all of these shorts will be worn this week so now i just need to decide what to pair with what we'll do this bra these shorts, these socks. Here's the outfit on my body. Um, so I'm wearing the training bandeau in this like powdery blue, baby blue color. I moved the strap over to kind of give me like more of a cute vibe, just give me something interesting. Um, and then these shorts, I don't remember the color, but I will link all of the outfits down below. Um, but I just picked these up from Dreamshark. I really like the color. And then here are the socks. So I think we're ready.
Hey, it's Tuesday. I'm tired, but I have to do an upper body dumbbell circuit today. So let's figure out what I'm gonna wear. So I kept everything out that I laid out yesterday and I've been eyeing these shorts like all day yesterday. I picked these up recently from Gymshark, so I think it's only right that I wear these and there's literally only one obvious choice to pair with them which is this yellow training bra that matches the yellow accents in the shorts. So let's pop that on. All right, so here's the outfit. Um, yellow V-neck training bra. And then this like funky patterned short from Gymshark. And then I paired it with uh, let me see if I can do it. <laughs> Paired it with these pink socks from Aloe Yoga. So here we are. I'm ready to go. It's Wednesday, right? Yes, it is Wednesday. And today, instead of going to the gym, I am going to go play some tennis. Um, unfortunately, Gymshark training doesn't make any like tennis clothes. So I'm gonna kind of deviate a little bit. Uh, give me one second. All right, so I picked out this tennis skirt here from Allo Yoga. It's nice and lime green, and I figured I would pair it with this like lime green ruched training bra from Gymshark, and then wear these lime green socks with it as well. So let's put this on and let's see how it works out. All right guys, so here's the outfit. I ended up putting a top over the sports bra just because I felt more comfortable that way. Um, but here is the ruched training bra in this gorgeous lime green color. And then I paired it with the Aces tennis skirt from Aloe Yoga. And then also some lime green socks that match the bra perfectly. All right guys, so I'm back from tennis and I ended up deciding that I am gonna go to the gym literally in like 30 minutes. So I'm gonna change out of this outfit. But before I do, I figured I'd give you all like a verbal rundown on how everything performed. So as far as fabric goes, I'm gonna have to give it a nine out of 10 because the skirt, like after I sweated, it dried, but you could still see like the dried up sweat. So that's not that cute. And then um, as far as overall comfortability, I'm gonna have to give that a 10 out of 10. I felt very comfortable in it. And then for cuteness, also a 10 out of 10. I received so many compliments while wearing this outfit. So that's always good. As far as what I'm gonna wear to the gym, um, I'm just going to keep with the theme of the neon green. Hopefully, I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, I am. I am. I'm going to do it. And I'm just going to wear these lime green training shorts. It matches the bra. It matches the socks I already have on. So it'll just be a really quick transition. So time for me to head out of the door and go to the gym and do a workout that I have not planned yet.
So this is what we're working with. Um, today is an upper body day. But I pretty much, you know, I don't know. I mean, I have shorts. That's a given. I'm kind of like, I noticed how limited the options were for this video because it was like all shorts. But what can you do? But I, I think I want to wear these shorts. And then like, I could either go with this bra here. But I'm, I don't know. I'm in the mood for blue on blue. I just did like green on green on green. So kind of like don't want to keep being super basic so I don't know I'm like eh, there's this I don't know if that's going to be a good idea for an upper body day but let's let's put it on let's see how we feel about it all right here is the outfit I actually really like it um this is the, I think, V-neck bralette. I think that's what it's called. And then, of course, shorts. And then I just paired it with some white socks. Um, it's like one of those things where it's like, I know I'm making a bad decision, but it's cute. We'll see. I won't, since I am knowingly wearing this bra that I know to like have like not the best support on an upper body day, I'm not gonna rate it poorly because I kind of already know what I'm getting myself into. But um, I will be sure to kind of note whether or not, you know, it was as bad as I expected it to be. I will at least do that. So here's the outfit and I'm gonna head on out. All right guys, so I'm all done with my week of Gymshark training. And now I just wanna like share my final thoughts. So I will say Gymshark training is like very comfortable. And also it's like easy to wear. Like you don't have to think that hard about it. You just throw on, you mix and match. And it's like somehow it just still looks cute, which is like really nice. It's like, for days when you just don't want to think about what to wear, those pieces, they're A1, like they're perfect. I pretty much only had like one like, I guess, issue, well, besides this bra, like showing all the breasts, but the ruched training bra, I noticed that compared to the other bras, like, it's a lot, like the band is a lot more tight around my rib cage. And like, I have like wide ribs, so it just made me feel like uncomfortable. And it kind of reminded me like why I hadn't reached for those bras in a while, just because it just made me feel like, it makes you look boxy essentially. And like, it's just not flattering. So like the day that I had on the, like that lime green ruched bra, like I put a t-shirt on over it just because I didn't like look super flattering. So that was like probably like my only like memorable um, complaint um, during the week. And then, I mean, I guess overall, like mm, reaching into my closet and like pulling these training items out 
it made me kind of like look back like I was looking back at like my old photos like from a year ago when I was wearing certain training pieces like I know I have a picture of me wearing these shorts and like I noticed like how much my body has changed over this year um and I mean that's a whole different topic for a different day but it just made me realize like re-wearing the clothes that I was wearing like a year ago like how much my body has changed um and so it kind of like sent me into like a mini existential crisis but you know I'm strong I'm determined I will just you know push it and I guess you know make better choices so that uh I guess I'm trying to like sugarcoat the fact that like I gained weight and I noticed it once I put the clothes back on. That's all. So <laughs> that's it. Um, but yeah, other than that, like I said, I loved everything. Like it was really nice to kind of go back down memory lane and then to also try out some new items. Um, I love the socks. You guys get those socks. Like they're so good. Like and they're so cute in the colors everything like I hope Gymshark comes out with more of those socks I know that's like a really random thing but like they're nice those are some good socks um but yeah that is everything um my next workout split it starts tomorrow and so I'll be doing this all over again picking a new theme and wearing it and reviewing it so with all that Goodbye, chat with you next time.